Bring you a live look at Dallas Love Field Airport this morning. Hundreds of thousands of people have traveled here to North Texas to take in the Great American Eclipse. Airport officials say they're expecting to see about 130 thousand passengers in just the next few days. Oh, the roads are going to be very busy as well. The Dallas Office of Emergency Management, well, they drafted a traffic plan focused on keeping emergency routes open and man, man, maintaining rather uh, access to hospitals and the highways. As you can imagine, there's going to be a lot of partying going on as well. <laughs> Chris Sadegi is live in Mesquite. That was a gorgeous shot yeah. there. And Chris, you're telling us about the events happening all across our area. Everybody's excited. The day is finally here. Oh, yeah, this is the day we waited for, Dia. You know, who knew there were so many different ways you could look up to the sky? But that is the case. There are so many different ways to celebrate the total eclipse. If you want to be out and celebrate it and observe it with others. Let's show you a few that are happening in Dallas. First of all, Reunion Tower and the lawn below, they're having an event. The Arboretum in Dallas, a sellout crowd expected there. And then the place that I'm gonna be later today, the big event at the Cotton Bowl at Fair Park. Thousands of people looking skyward across the way in Tarrant County, Grapevine Main Street. They always are up for a celebration. We know that. And this day, no different. Also, the Fort Worth Museum of Science and History will have a lawn party with science experts on hand to help explain exactly what is happening with the eclipse. Lots of other fun as well. Elsewhere, South Fork Ranch in Parker, Addison Circle Park, and Ripley's Believe It or Not in Grand Prairie also holding some fun events as we count down to totality. Too many events for me to name here, but if you go to WFA.com, you can see the full list. We've compiled them all. You're not going to have to go very far. I'll tell you that. There are lots of them. Hopefully, you have the day off. Hopefully, you have glasses and Hopefully you enjoy this piece of history. Speaking of history, this event here in Mesquite, you're going to want to see this. I'll explain coming up in 30 minutes. Dia, back to you. Can't wait, Chris.